Walking Dead Season 2 with Jenny the Pirate. Welcome back, Lucky Charm. Wow. Nothing. Why are we doing this? It's fucking dumb. Yeah, it is. Because it's safer this way, and I'd rather be sure. Yeah, <sighs> I can't believe this. Yeah, really? You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. She sounds like me. It's gonna be okay, surely. All right, we're in here. A life preserver. That'll help me. No. Oh, okay. An anchor. It's heavy. Okay. Boat. Was there a boat in here? I don't think a boat would fit in here. Let's see. Ooh, a hammer. <gasps> That's useful. To find a way to get that. What else? A barrel. Coffee. Blue mojo, is that that said? Okay. Toolbox. Oh, it's a tackle box. We were a fisherman. We lived here. Not much left in here. Okay. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Ew. Wow. Pull board. Pry board. Let's get a hammer first, if we can. Ooh. Look at all those tools that aren't there anymore. Clark face. How do I get this? Oh, I can't now? Just can't. No, you can't have it. Alright, what's up? Ugh. Cry? You need the hammer. Like, come on. Don't break the knife. Oh, scared me. Uh, a hammer? Can I. What do I do? Oop, what's this? Here we go. This looks sturdy, doesn't it? This would be good. Accidents waiting to happen. Oh, okay. Ew, the arm. So gross. Okay. Stupid hammer. No problem. Here we go. Give me that. And a rake. That's it? Okay. Hammer. Hammer time. Let me out of here. I'm sure you're gonna lock a kid in the shed on a freezing, stormy night with an almost infected arm. S negligence. Negligence. Stupid people. I miss my old survivor group already. Oh. We have a doctor. He's gotta have stuff for stitches. Gross. Oh, okay. I hope we kept our hammer. It's pretty safe in there. It'll be a good place to stitch up my arm. Alright, needle, peroxide, and some bandages. So we can use fishing wire to stitch our arm. Nice. Open. Op I can just open? Open? Why would I want to open the windows? Come on. I'm gonna break in. Ooh. Do I really want to break in? I'm scared. No. I think it's getting worse. No kidding. Reach. Too high. Oh, surely we can climb up here. What's wrong? Oh, I can go <clears throat> past. Nope. Okay. Plywood? What's this? Okay. We can definitely deal with that. 
let's finish looking. This is a stupid house. Oh! Can I watch? It makes me feel like a fucking idiot when we're not on the same page. We well, are on the same page. Get thing. on it. There we weren't. Not about the girl. I saw you get soft. Why is that bad? What do you want me to do, Beck? Put a bullet in it? I know. I want you to think about our family first. It's all I think about. Oh. So don't give me any shit. I know, he's being tender and humane. I need some air. I get that you're scared, lady. This man's a good man. Alvin. Alvin, will you help me? Ooh, I feel bad. Oh. Hi. <gasps> I know. I'm a bad girl. But I'm gonna die. Will you help me, what please? What the hell are you doing? Please help. You left me in this shit. I'm not gonna hurt anyone. I'm not gonna hurt anyone. Please yeah, help but me. but you're gonna get me in trouble. Please. I need to fix my arm. Please help me. Are you out of your mind? Even if you ain't bitten by some lurker, which you probably are, uh -huh. you can't be here. Well... You gotta get out of here, you understand? Get back into that shed and Carlos will take care of you in the morning. Damn it, girl, go! I'm sorry I bothered you. You should be. I don't have anyone who will help me. Come on now, don't get upset, don't get like that. I'm serious, you need to get out of here. I saw when everyone was arguing, you wanted to help. You didn't see anything. Oh. Look, you gotta get out of here before my wife finds you. I'm serious, you gotta go. I got enough problems already. I got a baby on the way, Rebecca's oh. all emotional. Got a mess of hormones causing all sorts of trouble. I don't need any more, get it? Now go. I don't want to get you in trouble. I'm already in trouble just talking to you. Please help me, Alvin. I could really use your help. I could really use your help. I'm screwed if anyone finds out I did this. You understand? I'm sorry. What do you need? Oh. The, bu the cut on my arm needs to be cleaned and stitched. Stitched? I ain't doing that. You don't have to. I'll figure it out on my own. All right, look. I don't know what I can find. We're short on bandages, but I might be able to find something clean that will work. I need something to clean it out with. And a needle and thread could help, too. I don't even know where to look. Oh. Carlos has medical supplies on lockdown. We don't got much these days. Great. Well, whatever you can get, I'll find the rest on my own. Yes. Okay, wait here. Oh, thank you, Alvin. Uh, I will remember this. How about that? <gasps> Scary. I found you some bandages. Oh, thank you. And I, uh, I got you a juice box <gasps> in case you're thirsty. I love you, Alvin. Thank you. Thank you. Alvin, house meeting in five minutes. Oh, really? Oh, okay, thanks. Now you need to go. There's an apple juice missing, Alvin. Where is it? Ugh. Well, he's good. I like Alvin, and I like Luke. Pete's okay, but don't be taking my arm. I, I need a needle and peroxide. Let's not go in the front door. Or should we go in the front door? How, how crazy are you feeling? I think we need to go under the house. Nope. Oh, of course. Yeah, okay. I don't think the front door. Let's go check that board. Let's do the board. I love Alvin. How do I get off the... Hello? Get me... What's up? Can I do it? What's up? Let's die. Locked? Okay. Ooh, okay. Needle and peroxide. Oops! Oh, shit. Come on. Nope. That way. Alright, Clemmy. Let's go. Do this. Well, I'm glad we talked to Alvin. I'm glad there are a couple kind souls left, even if, though they're the minority. It feels like they're the minority in real life, too. Say it isn't so. Tell me I'm just being negative. <gasps> Surely. Okay, let's compromise their house. Since they are compromising my life. I don't like Carlos. How about that? I don't even really believe he's a doctor. He's so crappy. They have running... 
Can I wash my arm out in the sink, perhaps? Oh. I'm so scared to break my knife. Hammer? No. Knife it is. Okay. We didn't need that knife, did we? Alright, here we go. Have you? Made my decision. Well, Have you? Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. Part of what? What are you discussing? scared. Are they going to kill me if they find me? Probably. Listen. What are you talking about in there? Could be. We don't know. She's connected to somebody. There's no way she's out here by herself. Alright. They're discussing my fate. And you know what? I got stuff to do. Okay. Fishes in this house. Duck. Oh, duck. Duck. Okay. What does it say? Julia Kim. Oh, girls' names, boys' names. Oh, okay. This is Alvin's and the lady's bedroom. The pregnant lady. <laughs> They're making names. A list of names. This is something happy they can think about, hopefully. Surely. You need good things to think about when everything's terrible. Keep going, keep going. Good things to look forward to really helps. This cabin's cool. Shh. Gone fishing. Is that me making a hot racket? Bathroom, bedroom, or bedroom. Let's check them all. I like being thorough, as you must know by now. Okay, what's this room? Okay. A watch. Whose watch? Am I being a thief taking this? Do they really live here? Or are they just crashing here? Because they're all scared about something. Ooh, can't? Okay. I want a jacket. Oh, no. Okay. Global. <laughs> what? Medieval? I can't read it. All right nothing in here. We lifted a watch. Did it say steal or pick up? Now I'm curious. Whatever. It's in my pocket now. Going in the bathroom, hoping there's supplies. Ooh, water. Can I wash my disgusting arm in there, please? No? No. A tomato with a needle. Yay. It's clean. Is it? I'll still need something to keep it from getting infected. Okay. One last thing. Can I? Let's... Okay. Oh. Uh oh. Okay. 
guess where we get to go. Oh, I can pick one? Okay, let's hide. Uh, maybe I should have picked the shower. Damn it. Hey, lady. How's she feeling? I just need to have this baby. <laughs> I can see why she let it be okay and let it be his. What? I can see why she'd be stressed out. Let it be his. Um like let it be her husband's. Um Okay. Not sure what to make of that. Is she gone? <laughs> Go away. I can't even conceive of being, aha uh -huh, pun intended, being a, a pregnant lady in this. Are you kidding me? I don't even know. What happened to Krista's? I guess, <gasps> I guess it's obvious what happened, isn't it? You're not supposed to be in here. No, I'm not. Hi. Can you please help me, kid to kid? Can you please help me? Please. I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. I will happily not tell him. What are you reading? What are you reading? What are you reading? A book? A what th book? I like books. It's called The Gurgles. It's about trans-dimensional body snatcher. <laughs> Cute. Cool. What happened to you? Yeah, please help me. A dog bit me. Stupid dog. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. It does. Your dad didn't give a crap. How about this? I could die if I don't take care of it. Do you understand? Please help me. I just need something to clean it with. I bet it would be with the rest of your medical supplies. Yeah, it is. Oh. I'll help you. Oh, Good. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Sarah. Thank you, Sarah. I'm Clemmy. I'm Clementine. No one's given a crap yet. No one cares. We're friends. Yes. Right? We can be best friends. Sure. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. Oh. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to, like, be my friend. And then I'll be super cool. Let's be yes. friends. Yes. We are friends. Yes, I'm promise? in pain. It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Do you promise or not? Yeah, I'll be your friend until you burn me. All right, fine. I get it. I promise. Relax. I promise. Let's be friends. Me too. Friends. Cool. Speaky swear. Please help me. I'm about to pass out from my arm. All right. A pinky swears forever. Okay, we're bros for life. All right, sister. I'll see if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a cut. Oh, good. Thank Let you. Let me look around. It'll be good stuff for you. Oh, all right. We have a friend. I think this is it. We have a couple friends now. That'll work. Oh, you thank you. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Yeah, it's Don't worry. Hurt. I won't. Okay. Thank you so much, Sarah. Okay, Sarah's good. Alvin's good. Luke is good. Thanks, Sarah. Pete is seems good, although he's kind of okay. serious. I better get somewhere safer to do this. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's go back to our little shed of sadness. Get in there. I should just pound down the stairs. That'd be funny. Thump, 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 thump. Surely you're still having your meeting about killing me, right? Let's go listen. Leave her out there to die. Better her than us. You'd have done the same thing. It wasn't the brightest idea. Oh, well, firing your rifle was, huh? Next time we can put the neon sign for the next one. Okay. They're stupid. Let's go. Let's be the only smart survivor. And go. Oh, 
we have friends. I love having friends. <laughs> so nice to have friends in the game of loneliness and sorrow. Yay. Home sweet home. Shed sweet shed. Ouch, let's deal with this arm. Yummy, this is not gonna hurt at all. Okay. Trophy. Oh, so gross. Okay. Okay, this is no problem. And apple juice. Okay. So I should probably drink the apple juice first to keep my power up. Because this is gonna make me want to faint. This is gonna suck. Oh, yeah. I can barely... Okay. Alright, let's have some juice. Good girl. Okay. I just wish it was better. I know. Okay, we're gonna make it better. Let's thread the needle first before we incapacitate ourselves in agony. Ugh. I had really bad road rash one time. Road burn, whatever, agony. No. Just like last time. Just how Crystal showed me. Last time? <gasps> Did she have to do a C-section on Krista? Wait, don't I need to disinfect? Wait, I'm not ready. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, can we disinfect? What's up? Yeah, do that. Ew, ew, ew. Oh, honey. Yep. Ew, ew. Ooh, disgusting. Okay, breathe. Okay. Breathe. Okay, I'm good. I'm fine. Yep, that's about how it felt cleaning the road. You had to clean it every day. Your delicious road burn, road rash. Okay, now. All right, girl. Okay. We're gonna force ourselves to breathe. We are gonna do something disgusting. Ew, so gross. Okay, and to the right. Ew, I know. I know. It's bad. It's disgusting. Okay. One step at a time. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Okay. After you do it, you can faint. Uh, surely. Come on! Ooh, this is really graphic. It's graphic till the end, so if it's really gross for you, just don't watch this part. Okay. Okay. Oh god. Ew. And uh. All right. Slow your breathing. Keep breathing, Clemmy. And uh. so uh, so nice. All right. Don't hyperventilate. Don't hyperventilate. Okay. And how many? Oh, gross! Ew. How many times do I have to do this? Yeah. Okay. I bet this was fun to voice over, moaning for days. Ew. Ew. Okay, you're suturing your arm. Now scream for five minutes. One effing more. Here, go. Oh, I did it wrong. What? Get it out. Come on. So ridiculous. Can I have more apple juice, please? <laughs> okay. <sighs> okay. That was so much fun. Okay. That looks great. I'm a Picasso. Yes. Picasso type. Calamity. Picasso. Whatever. Uh, yeah. I am apple juice. <laughs> okay. Don't throw up. All right, let's wrap this masterpiece. Oh, thank you, Alvin. Ugh. Why did I have to drop it? Well, it's not easy doing your own. I want to put more peroxide. Surely that was fun. <gasps> uh oh, uh oh, oh no! Hammer? Hammer! Oh shoot! I'm busy. A rake or what? Get the hell or a brick. Let's do this. 
Get away from me. Oh, Hacha. Get off. Okay. Get away. Ugh. Give me this. Kill him. How do I kill him? He's big. Oh, he's big. Die. Get away from me. I have to bandage my arm. Thank you. His head is still ahead. Come on. Deal with this. Yeah, whatever. Get him. Get him. Get him. Dig a hole. All the way. Yeah, go away. Can I please faint from exhaustion? Holy shit. What, what do you care? Ugh. How the hell did he get in here? I don't Looking know. Cool, tough as nails. Are you all right? The shed should have been safe. Surely. I'm still not bitten. I never was. And you left me out here to die. You people suck. You patched yourself up? Yeah. Did you get that stuff? Did she I steal from us? Yes, I did. This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already. Guys, please. I did. I took stuff. And I'm sorry. I really am. I'm and gonna... you think you can trust her? God damn it, don't even start. Any of you would have done the same if you were half as tough as this little girl. So just save it. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Oh, will you? Damn lurkers sneaking Stupid. around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? Yes. Is it a trick? Please, Luke. Luke, please help me. <laughs> you guys. This is the most dysfunctional crew of survivors. Stupid, crappy doctor. You like my stitches? Useless. This might hurt a little. Oh, will it? Ow. What, are you gonna poke it now? How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. Thanks. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? Stupid doctor. If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. Great. You're welcome. Thank you. Whatever. You're mad you didn't get to kill me? What's with that dude? They did just have an accident, obviously. It involved him. Oh, he gave me a real bandage. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. What? Useless doctor. I was hurt, and you weren't helping. Because we considered you a threat, which you were. Whatever. Fine. Maybe you still are. Yeah, I am. No, I'm not. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. Well, I'm a survivor. I should admire I'll that. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Oh, okay. What's she isn't that? like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. She's not a survivor? She knew how bad the world is. What is really like out there. She would cease to function. Oh. She's my little girl. Oh. She's all I have left. And I would ask that you stay away from her. This guy never met Charles. <laughs> she is. Uh. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any more mistakes. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. Really? I can eat food? That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. Whatever. At least I have, still have an arm. Yeah, better than losing it. Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Yep. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. <laughs> Definitely. Totally. Oh, Luke fed us. I love Luke. Ew, what? You come to make me feel bad for eating your food? What? Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry oh. for, well, for being a dick out there. Oh. I got kind of aggro, and 
That was definitely not cool. Oh, he knows about aggro. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. It's cool. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. Oh. I just... Uh, we had a bad experience once. Cool, okay, thank you. I certainly understand that. What happened? Uh, am I allowed to ask? What happened? Oh. Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. Oh. It was my fault. It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but oh. we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. Aw, oh, Nick. And there was nothing we could do about it. Bummer. Anyway, hopefully you understand. I do. And I'm impressed you talked to me about it. Ew, bad things happen to everyone. Yeah, I do. Bad things have happened to everyone. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I don't really have a plan. I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. We're winging well, you're it. You're welcome to stay here if you want. Oh. Okay, let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. Thank you. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. Is that so? So... What happened to your parents? Which ones? If you don't mind me asking. Just my blood parents? I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. And there's my dad's. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. They died. That's tough. Yeah. I, uh, I lost my folks, too. Hey. I'm sorry. I... I shouldn't have asked. No, it's fine. Yeah, I did try to find him. My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them. But they were already dead. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He's the reason I keep my hair short. What uh, happened to him? Ah, <sighs> well... this I ran away I was stupid there was a man who said he knew my parents I thought I knew what I was doing but I ran away and Lee died because of it yeah. maybe he would have died anyways it was my fault I just sometimes people die because of me ooh whoa I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch, and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, no yeah, kidding. It's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. Couple fresh brookies for dinner? Hmm, wouldn't that be nice? Sure, everything's great. Hi. Oh. Not much for words, huh? Well, I get fed. I'm stitched. Oh, you're still here. Oh. Oh. What's up with you, lady? Miss, I hope it's his. Ew. It's your I story. wouldn't be comfortable if I were you. Oh, okay, Krabby. Maybe you fooled everyone else, but not me. About what? Yeah, what? What? Who? Don't pull that shit on me. I'm not my husband. Oh. What? 
I'm sorry. I don't understand. Yes, you do. Okay. I just needed some help. Well, you got it. Good. Now go. Ugh. I won't stay long. Good, because I don't trust you. And stay the hell away from my husband. Ew. What's that mean? Gross. I'm a kid. <sighs> Relax yourself, lady. Relax yourself. Gross. Stay away from my husband. Why? He's too human around me? Aren't you about to have a baby? Don't you want a human? Or did you want a zombie? Or a monster? Or somebody horrible? I want a mean person. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Yeah, what's up with her? Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her bite. Oh, that's good. What's her problem? What's up with her? Yeah, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. Oh, nice bridge. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? Yes. By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. I haven't done rifles yet. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. <laughs> Nick was about your age. First time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle. He lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. What? He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. Oh. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Oh, that's sad. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? <laughs> you know where the river is, boy. Oh. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, oh. when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Because you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. <laughs> oh, damn. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. Ugh. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well, I didn't know that. It's fine. He apologized. It's all good. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing oh. a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. Wait, I want to. I want to hear the rest of the story. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's, figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Ooh, I'll bet. Sometimes you gotta play a role, even if it means people you love hate you for it. You should tell him, but he doesn't hate you. He doesn't hate you. He looks up to you. Nick's father wasn't there much, and he was a piece of shit when he was. Ooh. So it fell to me to keep him in line, raise him right. Meant I couldn't just be nice Uncle Pete. Uncle Pete! Ooh. Well, you're still Uncle Pete. Nick! Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Oh. Oh. These were people. Oh. These were people. What the hell? Ah, full of holes. Ew. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet. But it ain't your average gang of thugs. That much I know. Yikes. Think about it. You're Carver. What do you do? Who's Carver? Carver? You guys keep saying this Carver. It's a great name. Check those guys there. Really be nice. careful. Some of them might still be moving. Nice name. Sounds like a nice guy. Ew. Wow. Okay. What can I do? A slaughter zone. See if you can find anything else. Okay. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. Is he shot too? Yeah. These fellas got lit up something good. Ew. Well, let's stay out here. Ew. 
His jacket is familiar. This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. Is that? Check for ammo. Alright. Can I help? I got it. Hey, Are you sure you're okay? Krabby? Ask my uncle. He knows everything. Oh. Yeah, you guys should chat. You need a chat. There are more out there. Yikes. This wasn't no rinky dink pissing match. What was it then? Is that Roman laying there from Fubar? Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Four hundred days. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down. We gotta get out of here now. Jesus Christ! Get a hold of yourself. Can we get out of here? Looks right. This doesn't look good. No, it don't. But one of these folks might still be alive, and they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. Whoa. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. <sighs> Whatever. Come on, Clem. You want to be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. I'd be more useful with a gun. I don't doubt it. At some point, you guys have to trust me. Hell, I trust you. But not everyone's at that point yet. Give them time. Look, just keep your head on straight. Ew. Same deal. All shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. Okay. They just look like innocent people. <laughs> what, like farmers and innocent people? <gasps> My backpack. Are these the people that hurt Krista? That's one of the guys. <coughs> what happened what to you? What happened to you? <coughs> Hello? You were in the woods with Krista. Yeah. The woman I was with. What happened to her? Oh, please. Please. Tell me. Tell me. Is she alive? <coughs> please. What? Oh, come on. <coughs> tell me about Krista. Here, tell me about Krista as I sprinkle it upon your lips. Ew. <coughs> Krista? Thank you. What? Ah! Turn the favor? No. Okay. Pete! I'm fine. Are you? I'm fine. Just... Just lost my footing! He screamed. <gasps> God damn it! Oh, shh. He got bit. Lurkers! I'm out of ammo! Alright, Pete's bit. Bitch. Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of I'll you! I'll cover you! Cover him? We gotta get out of here! Get over here, God damn it! Can't you listen to me once? Help Just Pete? One time? I've got... Come on! He's bit. Let's help him. <laughs> like he wouldn't help me. He kind of did help me though. What? Hey, let's get this. Hacha? A hacha. Was there something better? Ew. Can I hit it in the face? There we go. 
Oh, Pete. Run. We have to go. All right. Ooh, next time on The Walking Dead. What are you going to do? Cut it off. Ew. Gross, are you? Are you gonna make me cut it off? Someone's outside. Are they? Trick or treat. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Oh. Did he say what his name was? We know damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. Someone. What's he gonna do? They're very scared of. I can't keep going. Ew. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. Of walking? We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. <gasps> oh, the chills. The chills. Oh my god. Goosebumps all over myself. All right, here we go. My choices. Survival. Did you try to save Krista? Hell yes. But evil people. Mercy, did you kill the dog? Yes. Sam. Rip Sam. Trust, did you accept Nick's apology? Sure. He was shaken. I, I get it. I, I get it. Not everybody is built for this. Generosity. Did you give water to the dying, stupid dying man? Maybe I shouldn't have. Hate him. You can't really be generous in this game. Okay, we went with Pete. Save? Did Nick need saving? I don't think Nick needed saving. Well, then he's kind of a maroon. Oh, here we go. So Luke is actually in Guardians of the Galaxy. He plays Star-Lord and uh, Quill, I guess, the same character. There's some little funny things about him, but I won't tell you until we've seen what's up. Just like little actory things. I remember this one. You make decisions in the episode and then the next episode, it will show you what your awful decision was. And I remember having to do a lot of replaying of this season. It was very irritating. As I'm playing it, I'm, I'm re remembering the dog. I mean, whether you feed the dog or you don't feed the dog, the dog attacks you. Either way, it's just... Ugh. This is one of the games where people really complained a lot about. Your choices mean so little. It's still a good story, though. And you do still get to choose. You get to choose your ending in this one. That's one thing I actually really respect about this one. You get to choose your ending. And there's a lot of controversy over your final decision where you end up. So I look forward to getting there with you. I hope you're having a good week, Lucky. This first episode took a little while to get into, but the next episode, I think, is it picks up. It kind of picks up pretty suddenly. We have more interesting characters to meet. <laughs> Just you wait and see. It's a pretty song. Too bad I can't play it for you. <laughs> Copyrights. So Skybound, who's Robert Kirkman, the man who is the Walking Dead comics man, creator, they picked up 
The Walking Dead. So they're going to finish... They're going to finish the final season for us. It's going to happen. He will make sure that Clementine's story is finished. So now we just have to be terrified what they're going to do to her. I don't trust them. I don't trust Telltale. I guess we were right not to trust Telltale. Sad. Well, we can still love the art that they made. We can still love the art that they made for sure. Because it's beautiful. Cool, Lucky. Season 2, Episode 1. It's a rocky beginning, but it gets better. I'll see you next time in Episode 2. Have a good one, Lucky. And I'll see you soon.